everybody, how are we? My name is Unicorn Pondu. Welcome back to another video. And we finally got the shopping video that I thought that we were going to be doing yesterday, but no. It took Chantal a whole, I don't know, like a, quite a while for me to sleep and then wake up and get ready. And also now I'm here, so <laughs> I guess because she's so busy doing no nothing. Actually, now I'm thinking about it. Anyways, I guess let's see what Chantal has to say today, shall we? Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> I could sure go for some new plus size clothing. I need a new outfit and an iron, but I digress. So I think we should go check out this plaza here in Thailand. And it is apparently made up mostly of plus size clothing. So. I mean, I will give her props for actually trying in this video instead of just kind of putting up the camera going, hey guys, what we're going to be doing is going to be go shot. Like I will give her props. She is trying. Let's go. Yellow. Good morning, Bangkok. All right, I'm gonna call a taxi to the plaza. Yellow. the fact that she needs a gimbal and that or just a girl turn on the image stabilization i ha also have a samsung there's an option for it you're welcome so that way you're not waddling as much but yeah generally she's actually editing this video not super awful girl where was this kind of content like and slash or like editing months ago <laughs> myself to a more luxurious ride in the bolts it's called comfort level instead of economy it's a little more expensive like double the price but today's my day so i'm surging <laughs> nice breeze <sighs> these are some vendors across the street from the hotel i mean it had to include food somewhere guys come on there's a lot of these on every street in bangkok I think they made a mistake and they gave me a small car, which uh, this is how I'm sitting. I, I never sit properly anyways. <laughs> Unfortunately, that looks like a very average sized car, ma'am. You're just big. Sorry to tell you that. It's also written all over her face what she's feeling right now. I paid double for this and it's too small. And I just wanted something nice for me for once, but it's too small. And the day is ruined because it's like... <sighs> Couldn't have happened to a better person. Regardless, I enjoyed the ride anyways. It was air conditioned and in the end, it didn't really matter to me. I basically just wanted to show you guys what the streets of Bangkok look like or some of them anywhere, at least in this area that I was going. It's, uh, you know, different and some people don't get to travel, so they might want to see what the streets look like. Now, this doesn't doesn't represent all of Bangkok, obviously. Um, there are 7-Elevens everywhere, though, but uh, these are just some clips I took from the drive there to the mall. Yeah, I really want to visit someday. <laughs> I got dropped off somewhere. I have no idea where I am. So I'm using my GPS. He dropped me off at the wrong location. But anyways, <laughs> we're on adventure, right? I think I'm going the right way. Oh, wow, fruits and things. Yeah, the tone of her voice, the fact that she got dropped off at the wrong location, the fact that she paid double for that, and also on top of that, the car was small. It couldn't have happened to a better person. This is a lovely walkway. I'm getting pretty hungry. I haven't eaten anything yet. Okay, when I find this store, I'm gonna be tired. <laughs> That's okay. Let's see. 
So this is the Platinum Fashion Mall. A lot of plazas here. And the one I'm going to is for plus size specifically. Okay, I found it. The Krong Thong Plaza here. All right, so let's go in. Decorated with nice flowers, I like that. Okay. All that we see feels so nice. <laughs> plus size. This doesn't look too plus size, maybe. I think they're upstairs. 150 baht, not bad. The lady stopped me and said she had big sizes, but I wasn't really feeling the outfit, so I'm gonna have a look and see. Just having a look around here. Silax Big Fashion. Oh, let's see what their biggest size is. I like this dress. How do I say this in the nicest way possible? It's giving li Little House on the Prairie like pillowcases or bed sheets, right? Anybody else? No, yeah, okay. I'm gonna get this black one in size 60. She measured me on size 58. Yes, I like it. Looks very light material, like it won't be hot. All right, let's go. <laughs> Chubby. <laughs> she looks like some cute t-shirts here. Mickey. That's cute. I like that shirt. Well, we're gonna come back. We're gonna look at all the stores and uh... oh, you people. I need that. <laughs> oh, I love those dresses. <laughs> Enjoy plus size. Look at that nice dress. All right, so I have to do a voice over here because they were playing louder copyright, probably copyright music. So I was just browsing around, but virtually every store or booth in this plaza alone has a lot of plus sizes. I think this is so cute, don't you guys? No. No, no, I don't, unfortunately. Oh my gosh, so we're arriving at a store called Fat Girls, and they have some cute pants, look at those. And they also have um, some shirts here that I like. I love this style um, for modest clothing. I like these long style shirts and these pants look so comfortable and light. I really should have gotten some, but so I love this the name of the stores here. They have like fat girls and um, all kinds of. Yeah, in China, I've also heard that it's pretty similar when it comes to the names of the, the bigger stores, quote, quote, but uh, the names are really cute, I will say. Interesting names for plus size clothing. I love this shirt as well, but they didn't have my size. And uh, that's too bad because I love the patterns. There's even a place called Fat Boys. <laughs> a place called Fit Fat. Gay storm. All right, now I've done the shopping. I've spent enough, so I'm getting out here. Plus, it's so claustrophobic in here. So I've done my share. Now I'm gonna go relax and have lunch and some shisha. So after the mall, I came to a cafe I like here that is halal. So it's like a halal restaurant and a shisha cafe. So I ended up getting some fresh crispy fries and a- Oh no, I wonder why she feels so awful and just trip and groggy and like super slow and tired all the time, guys. It's a complete mystery. Shish tauk wrap, which was actually very quite nice. And so were the fries. The fries were nice and crispy and they had really good mayo. And after I ate, I moved to the shisha lounge and ordered a cappuccino, which was delightful. And I relaxed with some shisha. I really love the environment. It was really, really relaxing. All right, I'm finally back home. I've got a couple of things, but that's about it. <laughs> so they have a lot of selection, actually. It's like a whole plaza of just like plus size. And I will um, get more eventually, inshallah, but I do have my team of stuff as well. But anyway, so first thing I got was this dress, <laughs> this black one. So I'm gonna try these clothes on for you, but I just wanna say like, I didn't spend more time in the mall because I just like, I can't do crowded malls, man. I can't. I try. I can't. Like, the way that it was designed, it was very narrow and, like, inside. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but... Narrow, aka she's too fat for it. It was triggering my claustrophobia, so I just uh, got what I wanted, found some things, and got out of there. I'm not... I know somebody who could shop for hours, like, all day. I'm just, like, an in-and-out person. So, yeah. I, um, I got these couple things here. So I got this, this shirt. I'll show you in a minute. And I got this one. These look like a lot of shirts I've seen on Timu all 5xl their biggest size so let's see how this fits i like the maroon color so um yeah i'll be right back i'll put these on and i'll show you what they look like no 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 girl no app uh, no 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 like everything included no mm -mm. like it might fit true but no 
I'm going to say it. She looks like a placenta. I'm sorry. That's the only thing that comes to mind when I say that. There's nothing wrong with placenta. Okay, great. Love that. Love you ladies for it. But just, she looks like a placenta. Like, don't deny it to yourself. She looks like one. Um, so, it's a little snug, but, I mean, it's not bad. Well, it's definitely not good if you were going to be asking us that question. I just don't find it very flattering. It should probably be a lot looser. I guess I'm going to have to lose weight, because there's no way I'm going to return it. But I really love how it looks. Like, it's really nice. Like, the color, you know, it's just very apple. I'm wearing my, my elephant pants. Mmm. Maybe if I pull it up a little like this? I don't know. <sighs> Alright, and then there's this one. Yeah, this one is nicer. This one is flowy. Yeah, Little House on the Prairie. And for some reason, the first thing that came to my mind the second that she put it on was The Hills Are Alive with the Sound of Nashies. <laughs> but, I mean, it's better than the last one, but, um, but if you have options for other options, go with those other options. So, I love it. It's so light and airy and flowy. Wee, wee, wee. Yeah, this one, you know, I like it. I like it a lot. So, yes, this one is a winner. It's very light. It's not see-through. I should have got a few more of these because this is more comfortable. Yes. You can find dresses there at this place for, you know, starting at, like, usually I see the average, like, for something like this, 200 bots. Um, so, yeah, but I've seen some dresses go up to, like, 1600 so it just depends <laughs> where you're going what you get and you can always bargain so i didn't have to bargain this but she gave me a discount so yeah she charged me t uh, 210 i think 210 bots and it was like 280 so but yeah i really like it i find that this color black and white goes good with red lipstick which i love i know you guys want to see me in more colors but <sighs> i love this but i did try this one and the maroon one but um yeah unfortunately there's like no try you can't try things on there there's no um changing rooms or anything and i remember seeing a note on that when i was looking up the mall that they don't have any change rooms so you're pretty much on your own with you know <laughs> and yeah um overall it was okay um but I just get like really bad anxiety when I go into busy crowded places. Okay, so she went to the mall, made an entire video for two things. Girl, just throw the entire video out the door at that point. There was no reason for this. I, I was expecting at least five minimum and we got to boo. It was pretty crowded. The hallways between the stores are not very big. So if you don't mind that, then you know, but, but the staff were very, very helpful. And um, so, um, but like I said, the one lady did measure me. I was a 58. The other lady at this other store, um, I got this one at the Fat Girls booth, and she didn't measure me, but she said she thought it would fit. And I mean, it does, but it's just not baggy. It should be baggy. So maybe it's the pants I'm wearing. I don't know. No, it's too big, but unfortunately, because she's so fat lengthwise, if you go back and look, it fits, but just around her midsection, it stretches because Chantal is fat wide, but also fat long. <laughs> so if that makes any sense. But we'll see, <laughs> I'll make it work. And um, this one she did measure me, yeah. So this is a 60 and I'm a 58. So that's why there's a little bit of extra room anyways. So yeah, um, but typically Asian sizes are made smaller, but this seems to be true to size uh, mostly, especially it depends on the shop there. But um, I just thought the names of the stores were super hilarious. You know, um, I love calories. Uh, fat girls, like, I thought they were really funny and made me laugh. So yeah, but um, it's it's not, it's very chaotic in a lot of ways. Like if you're not used to the hustle and bustle, like catching a ride, uh, you know, like the store was on a busy street. So I had to just like, the cab had to pull over for a split second. I had to like get in fast and just, it's very fast paced here. That's what I should say. It's very fast paced. So, and I'm slow paced. So, but anyway, I survived. I'm back in the AC and I'm very happy with this shirt. Yes, I really like it. They had a purple one. It was like purple, but I don't know. I, I was like, am I gonna look like Grimace in this? <laughs> Girl, it's at the point right now to where if you find something that fits you and you like, buy every single color and probably doubles of that also. So we can't go wrong with black and white. Anyway, it's very cool because you know, it's hot here. So that's what I need. So, and this with the team and stuff, I can't wait to show you guys when I go home, you know? So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this little vlog coming shopping with me and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. All right, well, it started out so strong, but then by the end, it just fell apart so fast. <laughs> the beginning of this video, great. Like, 75% of it afterwards, oh god, it fell off so hard anyways. With that being said, though, thank you guys so much for watching, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.